morning everybody it is vlogmas day eight i am working from home today so i'm gonna try to film like a day in the life i don't know how far i'll get because i get busy at work sometimes so we shall see so i'm really like this morning i said that i was going to make my breakfast vlog that exercise vlog that and like now I'm at work and I'm hella nervous because I have this huge presentation that I've been working on for the last six months. And this is why I'm giving you uh, Steve, jo <laughs> Steve Jobs fashion right now. Um, wish me luck, I hope the meeting goes well and I'll try to vlog the things I said I would be vlogging. I'm gonna try this cocoa latte peppermint spoon in my coffee, so it's just regular Nescafe with heavy cream in there. I'll try the spoon, I'll let you guys know how it, how it turns out. Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. It's Candy and we are on day eight of Vlogmas. So first of all, I wanna pat myself on the back. Like I'm still here, I'm still in the trenches, I'm still doing it. So the reason why I'm dressed like Steve Jobs is because today is a work day for me. I had a very long day, a long presentation that I am so happy that it's behind me now. I'm gonna sleep well tonight and probably have a cocktail or, or four. Um, the other day, if you were watching Vlogmas Day 4, uh, you would see that me and my mom, we went to Marshall's and I also went to Five and Below. I didn't get an opportunity to like do a haul for you guys, so I'm just going to show you what I got that day um, when we went. So I saw this like, um, it was a, an ugly sweater skirt, so to speak, and it had a bunch of bows on there. It cost maybe about $20 and I didn't want to spend $20 for something that I'm not going to wear anymore. So I got these bows and I'm going to try to um, film that for you. So the bows themselves were $3.99 and I'm pretty sure I have a black skirt that I can make it from. I'm not going to make it today, but that was the intent of buying these. Also, I can, I can use these for presents when I decide to wrap them. I don't know if I filmed this, but I also went to... Costco, maybe at the same day, and I got this little Nomi rug. It's very big. Um, probably gonna leave it up <laughs> after Christmas. Um, it was $10, so if there's a Costco near where you are and you need a outside rug, um, check them out. What else do I have? All right, so I got these organizing containers. There are one, two, three, four, and it's by a brand called Beano, the Lucid set of four. So I'm gonna use these to organize my bathroom, put like my makeup, um, facial products and everything. And this was uh, $16.99. I think it's a good price and um, if you wanna start your new year off in a better space, <laughs> I would recommend checking out Marshalls because they have a lot of like organizational tools so whether it be something like this or you need to organize your your sweaters or your shoes or even like if you want something to put your christmas decor in um, and so i got a 12 month agenda this looks erishly similar to what i had for 2021 i love lists i'm a person who, that has a list a list for my list um and i i got this because i felt like i didn't see a lot of 2022 it's kind of bent because i left it in a bag i probably will end up getting another agenda book um and this is 9.99 um again at marshall's so it has like calendar of course and then like you can write in your goals and so on so Oh, what else is in here? So if you've been following me for a while, you would have seen that I got this little reindeer pillow last year. So on my couch last year, there was just one of these. I was so happy to find this this year. So now I have a pair of them and you'll be seeing more of, I don't know what we're gonna call this one. Not Rudolph, maybe Prancer on my couch this season. 
and this costs uh, $19.99. And also from Marshalls is this my mind's eye baking cups so i'm probably gonna make some holiday cookies well not cookies cakes and i'll put them in this and what did i pay for this oh and this was 3.99 um, also from costco um you guys will see hopefully my tree has room for this so it's called holiday whiskey ornament collection and it's glenn livet so these will definitely stay on my tree because I'm definitely not interested in dark liquor or the outcome of dark liquor. So these are just for the purpose of decorations. And how many bottles do you get? One, two, three, four. Twelve bottles of whiskey. And they're in these little ornament shaped bottles. And this is available at Costco. I think it's about $50. Yeah, so I thought it was a really cute idea. And I needed some additional ornaments for my tree, so there we have it. All right, and so this is what the stuff I got from Five Guys, probably about fifteen dollars. Did I say Five Guys or Five and Below? I'm hungry if I said Five Guys. So I got this. I thought it would be cute to like make my my videos a little bit more festive. This little reindeer ear. And I think this was three dollars at five, five and below. <laughs> also got these little Christmas trees, similar to what I had last year. I probably put these on my work desk or put them in my bedroom just to you know, give a little holiday flair. It's giving very much glitter, so if you get these, keep that in mind. And these were like. It says a dollar, but I feel like nothing in Five and Below was actually a dollar, so that may not be true. Also, um, on my first day of Vlogmas, I talked to you guys about how much I love Home Alone, and so I got this holiday t-shirt. It's giving very much thin. You can see, you know, it's transparent almost, but um, once, once a year used, so I'm thinking that I got a good bang for my buck and again it was it was only what five five dollars um and i got another t-shirt so you probably see these in my vlogs or probably be part of my christmas pajama jam session and this says deck halls i guess putting the halls would have cost another dollar <laughs> can insert laugh um yeah, so ladies and gentlemen, that's what we have for the haul. So I did collective haul that was Marshalls, Costco, and Five Below. And now I think I've earned a drink. So let's go do that. I'm gonna show you guys. I'm gonna make a hot toddy. I've I've had it years ago, and recently when we went to Pennsylvania, um, I was reintroduced to it again. So. I'm just gonna make that and film it. If you looked at my Trader Joe's haul, you would see that I got a couple things at that time um, to make my hot toddy. So let's go do that. Okay, so I have everything set up for the hot toddy. So I found this recipe on Pinterest. You need orange slices, rosemary, I already washed them. Cranberries, I already washed them. I'm gonna use my shot glass, I love TNT. Uh, I got some Fireball the apple cider vinegar. So I thought I had enough cinnamon sticks. It doesn't seem like I have a lot. So I'll put a little bit of this ground cinnamon in the mix. So essentially what I do is I put all of this together except the fireball and I boil it for about 10 minutes. I'm gonna put that in the pot now. So I'm definitely gonna be using the eyeball method uh, with the cider. Dylan's not here, so it's just me drinking this. So don't need to do the most. Put my cranberries in there. I'm gonna use all the orange slices because I kind of like that flavor. Put the rosemary. Adding the cinnamon now. Not so as cute as I thought it would look. 
Um, and then I'm gonna put in some ground cinnamon because like I said, I don't feel like it had enough. Ooh, OD, let me add some, some of this. All right, put a little bit more cranberry just for presentation. All right, I let this boil for about 10 minutes. I just love the way that this looks. It looks so cute, right? Okay, so it's been 10 minutes, so it looks a little bit mushier now. I'm going to put the fireball in the cup and then pour this mixture in. Hopefully I only have one of these because I got a lot of stuff to do. So I'm gonna put that in first, and then I'm using a ladle to pour the mixture into the glass. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. The hot toddy, this one looks so pretty. I'm gonna drink it now. Hopefully I still get everything I plan on doing tonight done. And this brings day eight to an end. Thank you guys so much for spending the day with me or part of the day. I'm going to enjoy my hot toddy and try to get my life together. Happy Vlogmas.